Today we have published our draft climate change plan. What we're looking for is effectively by 2032 uh, that Scotland will have reduced its emissions by 66%. Um, so we're wanting to be as challenging as possible. But by being as challenging as we were in 2009, here we go, we've actually achieved and overshot the ambition. So I don't think there's anything wrong with being ambitious. Um, it stretches us, um, but it does take us into the future. And in the future, there are all sorts of new things that will become available. People are already aware of, for example, electric vehicles, uh, the possibilities that there are around that. So it's about having people think carefully about what it is they choose to do. And it's about governments thinking about what policies they need to put in place to help people in those circumstances. It is fascinating talking to young people because they get it. They get that um, the decisions that we're making will fundamentally impact on the lives that they uh, get to live in the future. Um, they're not responsible for um, the climate change that we're experiencing, um, but they are going to be the generation that inherits uh, our actions for good or ill. Uh, and I very much in Scotland want our actions to have been for good.